Hey everyone, it's Lena from the Land of Gods and we are doing the weekly reading for the sign of Leo, my lions. Sun, moon, rising and Venus for the week of October 18th till the 24th. Please remember these are general readings. Times, fluid and energies can be reversed. So please take what resonates and leave the rest for others to receive if you are here for the first time. Welcome aboard, welcome to my channel and if you have been kind enough to come back, thank you so much and welcome back. Leos, let's jump straight in. Your first card out from the Angel Answers Oracle deck is Meditation Brings Answers. There's a need to ground yourself, I'm told. Let's pull a couple of feelers from monology before we jump into the tarot what do we have luck is on your side lovely and nothing is yet set in stone so there's something going on in life that's kind of rocky right now or not so much stable let's see how this integrates with the tarot we are going to look into past present future energy clarify them and then get a final word from the spirit oh wow what happened leo cards are acting funny past energy for my lions please Past energy for my lions. Yeah, there's something stuck. There's the flow is not free. The moon. The past has lots of gloom and things that were not much in light. There were some things undercover. Really? Leo doesn't like that. Present energy, please. We have the Four of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. Letting go of something. And we have the Ace of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles. Lots of Pentacles. Wow. Leos, are we talking about money, money, money? Are we? Knight of Pentacles. Talk about Pentacles. Wow. Leos are generally not misers, so maybe in the past it seems like you were holding on to whatever you got, but now it seems like you are more relaxed. You are ready to take chance. And that, what you're going to do is bringing you some new opportunities. Nice. What's this moon energy in the past? What was it that was undercover? The moon, please. Okay. This new opportunity was kind of foggy. You couldn't really see it clearly, it seems like. It seems like you were not able to focus on something that was coming your way or not look into this direction because you were too caught up in your thoughts. You were too caught up in your thoughts to look into this new direction. It seems like you're letting go of that and this new opportunity is finally, finally arising, coming to surface, let's say. Page of Pentacles. We have got the Three of Cups. Yeah, collaboration. Working with people. Coming together with a new idea which has some potential. You're finally letting go of whatever this stuck up mindset that you had. This has got more to do with your mindset and less to do with physical assets that you were holding on to. No. And... You are ready to take that risk and you are ready to go 
ahead with some kind of a new idea, collaborating with people. And that's bringing you something great. Eight of Swords with Eight of Pentacles and Ace of Pentacles. Then why are you feeling so stuck? Maybe because it's not going as fast as you want things to go. Ten of Rods. And you are dropping something from, from the past. Yeah, that gloom that we were talking about. Luck is on your side. Nothing is yet set in stone. Makes me feel that you. this is more all to do with anxiety. Along with this Ace of Cups, the new beginning for which you have to really work hard, comes a lot of anxiety. You feel stuck because it's not going as fast as a Leo would want things to move. So it feels heavy, but you'll be able to drop this heaviness. There is something that's coming to an end. There is some kind of an undercurrent energy that I feel when it comes to this Ten of Rods. You are dropping something in the past and moving steadfast in the direction of this Ace of Cups. It might not go as fast as you would want that, Leo. But remember, Knight of Pentacles, every single step that this Knight takes is so well calculated there's really very very low chances of this failing so have patience i know no leo would want to hear that and do meditation the very first card that came in was this you know go within find some grounding this is making you feel a little uh, so yeah do that the final word for my leo to wrap up the reading please Okay, two more please. Final word for my Leos. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Ace of Wands coming again. We've got the Knight of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles and Ace of Wands. Yes, we've got Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. You are really, really focused on your Pentacles right now. You are really focused on some opportunity, some chance that has real potential. We've got three Aces here, my loves. We have got Ace of Rod twice and Ace of Pentacles. So something that you feel really passionate about, something that is going to yield some real dough in the future and that is the reason why it's so important to take every step really calculated you know you really need to think through every step taken and you are working towards your independence your financial independence your strength your major arcana is strength at the end of the day so you are really working on this self-sufficiency. You are working on that inner power, inner strength, feeling that strength again. So that's absolutely fantastic, Leos. Just have some patience and things are going to get better and things are going to move and don't feel so stuck. It's a wrap. Thanks for joining me. Namaste from the land of gods.